Hello there, I am Gianco from my Pokemon Yellow. In the last part, we took on the Suen City Gym, and Jim Weed and Misty, the tomboy. Jim Weed, I guess you could say. She's a tomboy. And then we also, uh, got the TM11 for Bubble Beam. We also stopped the Team Rocket Grunt, or just Rocket. Uh, he stole the TM28 Dig, he gave it back to us. The guy who he stole from, like, we tried to return it to him, but he didn't want it. So yeah. And now we went through the underground path, and now we're here. This is the route north of uh, Vermillion City, so yeah. So I have Bulbasaur front, or Brute Rift front. We also got Bulbasaur, uh, so that's pretty cool. I showed off its summer in the last part, but yeah. It's level 11 right now, so that's pretty cool. So let's, uh, let's take on some battles, actually, yeah. So here's a bug catcher, I believe. There aren't many bugs out here, yeah. I think this is like the only bug catcher on this route, actually. Yeah, there aren't many bugs out here, because this is in the Viridian Forest, man. Yes, two Pokemon. And well, first is a Weedle. Okay. Hmm. Do I want to? Let's see. I mean, this Weedle could no p poison sting, but uh, since Brute is half poison, it can't get poisoned, and it shouldn't. It, it should be neutral effective because it's grass and a uh, poison type. So we'll see what, how this goes. Just out of curiosity, how much does poison sting do? That much? Okay. And then, yeah, I got leech I used leech to get some, uh, HP back, cause that's pretty cool. Yeah. So, yeah, this might work, actually. This is gonna take a little while, but, uh, it should work. It's a nice little strategy I put up there with the leech seed, you know? Yeah, Brute, well, Brute Witch should be able to take this, take out this Weedle that's level 16. It's five levels higher than it. But, uh, with my strategy in mind and in place, I should say, uh, we should be in good shape, you know? One more tackle should do it. And then with the help of the Leech Seed, that makes it even easier for Brute Witch to finish this thing off. Awesome. Nice. So yeah, Brute Witch is in the level 12. Awesome. Caterpie, okay. Stay in, I guess. But, uh, I'm gonna switch out though, cause Cappy actually knows tackle, you know? <laughs> let's go for the tip, let's go to Tabasco. Cause it's gonna be super effective with uh, Ember and stuff. You know, Charmeleon's back sprite looks like that horn is like white, but like in the sprite it's like orange, you know? Like the rest of his body. And its head is like a peanut, a giant peanut. I mean, in my opinion, it looks like a peanut, honestly. <laughs> so yeah. It's crazy. Yeah, one hit KO, haha. <laughs> Weed, okay. Let's go back to Brute Root then. Give me the same strategy, I guess. Let's go for the Leech Seed. Let's get Poison Thing on us. Leech Seed missed. Dang it, he invaded the attack. Okay, whatever. Ay ay ay. Go for the tackle now. Let's get a string shot to lower boot root speed. But uh that's not that's the least of our worries right here. Nice. Tackle again, okay yeah. We got this. We got this, we got this. String shot again, okay. There we go, nice. One more attack off this should do it, yeah. We're in pretty good shape right now. There we go, nice. Brute was in level 13, so Brute would gain two levels in that battle. And he learned Vine Whip. Awesome. Nice. No, you're kidding. No, I'm not kidding. Sorry, man. Thanks for 160 Poké Dollars, though. So, yeah. Let's take on this guy. I think this guy might have a Squirtle, actually, so that's good for us, because Bulbs was at front. I'm doing this out of love. Leave me alone. Okay. Sorry, man. I challenge you to battle, so we have to battle. Junior Trainer Male, okay. Let's defy. Oh, he has a weeping bell. Okay, I think in Fire on the Screen has a Squirtle. Like, I'm 95% sure. Hmm. 
We can try this poison powder. Didn't affect. Uh, oh, it didn't affect this. Should have said it doesn't affect. But oh well. Fine with okay. I could cut off some cool. We just need miss again. Or evade the attack again. Didn't affect me. We could. Ah, oh, come on. Is it because he's a grass type of one that I can't work? Grouth, okay. I think it's a grout. I'm gonna try one more time, but uh, dang it, rap. But I'm pretty sure. Ah, oh, shoot, attack it, use, of course. But uh, I'm pretty sure that if it's a grass type, it just evades the attack then. I could be wrong on that. Yeah, evade attack. Okay, I'm gonna switch to. I'm gonna switch to Tabasco then. Tabasco. No more Mr. Nice Steven. <laughs> I guess the vine would be getting awesome. It's not very effective. Okay, so let's use Ember on this thing. Does over half because good, good, awesome. Poison powder didn't affect the basket. Good. That's good for us. Let's get the vine up again. Okay. Let's use one more Ember. Hope wasting takes it out now. Yeah, there we go. Good, good, awesome. Oh my god, you train a male was defeated. Awesome. Now this can't be. Sorry, man. I don't need the number of pocket dollars you gave me. Dang it. I'm training for it, my love. Don't bother me. Okay. So I have to battle you because I, I requested a battle. So you have to battle. This is your training female. She has a Q bone. Okay. That's pretty cool. It's level 20. Um, let's try a vine whip on this thing. I could heal though, too. That'd be good. That'd be good, uh. You know, thing to do. Yeah. It's using the potion on to uh, root root almost at Tabasco. Now, I think if it has a ground type moves, it's gonna be super effective because, uh, root roots have poison type and, uh, poison type, ground type moves are super effective against poison type Pokemon. It's gonna growl on us. Okay. It's good for you, I guess. One more vine whip should do it. It's gonna tail up again. Okay. That's pretty cool. Nice. There we go, nice. I got it. Brute is in level 14, awesome. My textbook never. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Next for a bunch of Poké Dollars. Here is a person with a body fray, I believe. So yeah, it's another bug catcher. I have never seen you around. Are you good? Yes, I am good. I have, s I have five Pokemon right now. Or six Pokemon, including my, one of my HM slaves. I'm pretty good. I have two gym badges too. Yeah, he's a butterfree. Okay. So let's switch to Tabasco, I guess. Supersonic, no. Okay, we have to just hope that the fifty percent that he won't hurt itself in confusion will go. It will be on our side, you know, random RNG or whatever. Sleep powder, dang it. Okay, so, no, ah, no turning from a trainer battle. Okay, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry, I misclicked. I meant to go to my bag and use an awakening. Where's my awakenings? I might have passed it. Yeah, there we go, too. Okay, let's just use one on Tabasco. Poison powder, of course. Dang it. Well, I'd rather be poison. I'd rather Tabasco be poisoned than put to sleep, actually. I better fail the computes no more. Okay, cool. Yay. So it's gonna burn it nice, awesome. Okay, two more embers should do it. Hopefully, Tabasco doesn't faint from poison. Let's do three HP there. Ah, oh, confu- Ah, oh, supersonic. This could be- If it hits itself confusion and it hits her by poison, I think- I think that a p Tabasco is done for. I sh- I may have wanted- I may have sh I should have probably healed there. Cause, uh, yeah, if- if it would hit the self confusion and the poison would take effect. Hit by poison, that'd be bad, you know? Brutal is level 15, awesome. Tabasco is level 18, awesome. Need to fear about catcher, nice. Okay, you are too, you are too good, thanks man, thanks for 200 pocket dollars. Now I'm gonna use an antidote on, uh, Tabasco. And a potion on Tabasco. There we go, nice. Here is, um, some more trainers, I guess. Me, well, okay, I'll play. Okay, of course. Okay, yeah. Pip. 
Pidgey, okay. Assuming that this doesn't have wing attacking, it just has gust. We can try tackling it, see what she does. Send attack, of course. Nope, tackle missed. Guess this is normal type in this game, so. It only does that much, good. Just tackle again. Can gust again. May have wanted to use Leech Seed here, but that's okay. Tackle Mess, I'm gonna use an item and use a potion. Use it, uh, use, it used Sand Attack again, of course. Tackle hits that time, nice. And yeah, one more tackle should do it. There we go, nice. Yeah, I'm gonna switch out though to Storm. Gusts is normal, so I won't do that much. I actually do less if it was flying this game, you know? So yeah, this pitch is level 16, which is like the last one, and one at Kyo, nice. Pidgey, okay. Let's use, uh, let's go back to Brute Root, I guess. So this one's also level 16, jeez. Three of the Pidgeys are level 16, wow. Just doing a little switch root trick here. And yeah, let's get this quick tech on us, okay. Just Thunder Shock on this thing. There we go, nice. There we go, Boo is level 16, awesome. Just didn't work. Thanks for the inch toy pocket always, man. But Boo is evolving. Boo would have opened the Ivy's away. Nice. Let's take on this next uh, trainer. Huh, you want to talk to me? I want to battle you actually, but yeah, we can talk. Okay, this spirit probably knows pack, so uh, we'll go to uh, Storm, I guess. Just lend shock on this thing. Let's go to uh, Tabasco again, or not Tabasco, but Boot Root. Medicaid Sprite looks huge in this game. Just saying. <laughs> Let's go to Grumpy. Go for the wall kick. Oh, I missed, of course. Critical, of course. That's great. There you go. Critical, awesome. Nice. That's great for us. I didn't start it. Thanks for the 320 Poké Dollars. Here we are in Vermilion City. So actually, I want to put Lavender and switch with the Grumpy, actually. Lavender, we'll switch with Storm. There we go. Do I want to put anything in the PC? I don't think so. Nope, okay. So I'm going to heal up real quick, so I'll be right back. Okay, so if you go in this building right here, talk to this guy. He will give you, is a fishing guru. I simply love fishing, love fishing. Uh, do you like to fish? Yes. Okay, grand, I like your style. Take this and fish, young one. I guess that's what he said, that's the last part of dialogue. We got the old rod, okay. Fishing is a way of life. From the seas to rivers, go out and land the big one, young one. <laughs> so that kind of sounds like a Star Wars thing, young one. 
<laughs> okay, I forgot to explain what I was doing there. I was going back to the Pokemon. I was going to go back to my PC and deposit the old rod there. So that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, let's sit in here. I think you can trade. Uh, oh wait, no. Opens a Pokemon lands a HM that technically can't be replaced. Better think carefully before you teach HM moves. That's good to know. So this little girl, it's in Fire and Leaf Green. There's this little girl in this house that says, uh, she wants to trade a. She'll trade you. A, her Farfetch'd for a Sparrow, but I guess it's not in Gen 1, I guess. How do you get Farfetch'd in this game? So here's the Pokemon Fan Club, I believe. Yeah, Pokemon Fan Club. All Pokemon fans are welcome. Okay. So you go in here. The only person you really want to talk to is the President guy. Pikachu is in love with that Jigglypuff or whatever. That's pretty cool. It looks like a Jigglypuff. I think it's a Jigglypuff, actually. So let's talk to, this guy, talk to this guy. I'm the chair of Pokemon uh, fan club. Uh, I, uh, I think I've misread that. I have more than 100 Pokemon. I love them all. I'm very fussy when it comes to Pokemon. So, did you come to hear me brag about my Pokemon? Of course. Good, then listen up. My favorite, po my favorite Rapidash. It's cute, lovely, smart, plus amazing. And you think so? Oh yes, it's stunning, kindly, love it. Hug it when sleeping, warm and cuddly, uh, spectacular, ravishing. Oops, look at the time. I kept you too long. Thanks for hitting me out. I want you to have this. We get the bike voucher, which is awesome. Yay. I exchanged that for a bicycle. Don't worry, my fear will fly me anywhere. So I don't need a bicycle. I hope you, I hope you like cycling. I do, I do. So, uh, pick a tree, gotta go. Oh, that's a cool fairy. Cool. Peppy. Yeah, okay. My Pikachu is in love or something. But yeah, now he'll follow us. Okay. I think if you exit the house, or exit the building, he might have just automatically just keep, continue to follow you. So yeah, I just caught a Squirtle that was getting into mischief. I think it needs a good trainer to set it straight. So we can't get Squirtle until we have the Vilmarine Sage and Badge. So that kind of stinks. So it's gonna be a while actually, maybe two or three parts from now. <laughs> let's get by, let's buy, um, let's buy, uh, four super potion, I guess. Uh, let's buy like three more Pokeballs. I see what we don't need. Awakening, let's buy like one more since we used one on the last route. Pearl seals, let's buy two more. Repels, okay, let's buy like. I guess, uh, seven more, I guess. Cool. So let's see your bag now. Okay, so, uh, I want to put super potions up the front, though. Dang it. Oh, man, it switches to things. Dang it. In Fire and Leaf Green, it just, like, kind of, uh, it kind of just puts it above the one you select. So I have to do this. I have to keep on switching around for, for a second. Which is kind of annoying, but oh well. Gotta keep on doing this, you know? Rare candy. Escape rope moonstone. Moonstone under escape rope. Repels under the moonstone. I guess that's good enough, yeah. We're gonna, you, we're gonna go back to Sewer and City and get the bike really quick. So I'll see you guys back in Vilmarine, uh, Sewer and City, I should say. So I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, here we are back in Vilmarine, uh, Sewer and City. I mean, um, let's go to the, let's actually get the bicycle first, like I said. <laughs> okay. So if you go back to the bicycle shop and talk to the guy at the, the manager up at the, the counter, uh, let's talk to him. Uh, oh, that's a bike voucher. Okay, here we go. We exchanged the bike voucher for a bicycle. Awesome. Nice. And there's not like registering with a select in this game, you have to actually select it from your items menu. Which kinda stinks honestly, but that's okay. So now we can get on the bicycle. I like the bicycle music. I guess Pikachu rides in the basket in front, I guess. So yeah, let's go to the Pokemon, and uh, I'm gonna buy some more potions, cause they don't have any potions at the Vermont City, they only have super potions. Cause as you go throughout the game, the, the more, the, the higher, the number of cities as you go through, um, the number of new cities you go through and stuff, you'll get better items and stuff. That's, they're the sub better items. But I want to buy like four potions, honestly, because I used a lot of potions on that route. So yeah, let me see my, what's your items now? Let's see, uh, we have, uh, four, four super potion, uh, nine potion, uh, 11 pokeballs, 
uh, four antidotes, five prowl seals, uh, two awakenings, rare candies, uh, two rare candies, two escape ropes, one moonstone, one twelve repels, and that's a sticker and a bicycle. So it's pretty cool. So I'm gonna cut back to Vermillion City, so I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, here we are in Vermillion City. So, uh, I think the last thing we wanna do is, uh, go through, um, we can go through Diglett's Cave in the next part, actually. So yeah, Diglett's Cave, yep, okay, cool. Cause we wanna get the HM for Flash, so we'll do the next part, so yeah. So this has been trying to go again, I'm, this has been my Pokemon Yellow Walk to get part, the next part we'll take on Diglett's Cave and get HM05 Slash or whatever, maybe a different number actually for the HM. But yeah, so this has been trying to go again, I would like them to again goodbye, and I'll just guys in the next part of my Pokemon Yellow Walk to Guide.